Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 7 of Let's Play The Elder Scrolls Arena, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Okay, technically we are still in a bit of an arena of our own in Fang Lair. And we're just running into nothing but skeletons so far. Not that it's a bad thing, I mean right now we're capable of handling them. However, I would like to make sure that, you know, we're going to find a little junction to rest to in case we get our asses handed to us. Which, given our health right now, is pretty likely. Not to mention our vision in dark areas is not that great. Oop. Some random money is not too bad. And then we got a saber. I believe thieves can equip sabers, so that'll be nice to have. You know, as a backup plan. I don't know if sabers are better than broadswords. I probably had to look that up in my own time. I did get a critical strike there, which is great if you're a thief class. Whoa. You know, for having no muscles, they can run pretty fast. There. That skeleton is also deceased. Well, technically they were already deceased, but they're more deceased-er. deceased -er. Stay out of my laboratory, DD. <laughs> oh, classic Dexter's lab. Those are good shows growing up. How the hell is SpongeBob still around anyway? Like, that's like the ultimate lich right there. Stand the test of time, SpongeBob SquarePants. Like, they just, he just goes on forever. Okay, that was not indigestion as far as I'm concerned. Oh, I got stuck in the wall. The rock formation did not work in my favor. You died. Screw you, Rhea. I just had a little bit of a mishap, okay? It happens. Hopefully these dwarves took breaks because if they have no beds and I'm um, Pretty much shagged. Cause lots of darkness around here. That does not make me happy. The thing was around here that I got killed by a skeleton. I think he might have seen me. I don't know how they can see you. They have no eyeballs. They just got eye sockets. Like, how the hell does that even work? It's got to be magic or something that's allowing these skeletons to have, like, senses. Like, awareness of what's around them. I don't think skeletons growl like that. Or do they? Yeah, I'm out of a barrel. Look at me. I'm Donkey Kong. <laughs> a skeleton had gold pieces. How do they store it? They got no pockets. Oh, th this game. Well, not just this game, but skeleton culture in like fantasy RPGs and how they are able to hold the things they do. Despite, like, not wearing anything except, you know, their own natural structure, a bone. That's all they got going for them. Also, how the hell are there this many skeletons? Like, like you think of, like, dwarven ruins. Like, why are the skeletons not, I don't know, burlier? He just stood there and did absolutely nothing! What the hell? Okay, I'm really low on health, but... I'm still feeling it, like I'm Shulk from Xenoblade. At this point, I'm really failing it! Uh, I gotta see, like, what would happen if I did drop down there? Nothing. Okay, I'll just rest in this uh, shallow grave over here. 
Huh. Apparently you can use this as a junction to rest. I thought they were dangerous. But you know what? I feel so much better. Resting in a hole? Yeah. Yeah, I did it. I rested in a hole. Apparently they are also tunnels. Looking at my map there. But I don't want to, like, use a tunnel yet. Instead, we'll just keep going this way. Oh, we're bound to find, like, three or four more skeletons in just this area alone. Okay, 71 gold, a mark, another saber. Oh, my inventory is full. No, 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 I want to continue. I meant to go to my character sheet. Okay, let's uh, think about discarding my uh, 37,675 daggers there. Drop that. It's of no use to me. We'll drop this. Uh, probably drop another dagger, I suppose. Next time we go to town, we definitely gotta sell a lot of this crap. Like, I don't think I can equip magical stuff, can I? Uh, probably not a good idea. I'm moving a bit lighter, actually, in all likelihood. So I'm just going to leave everything the way it is. Yeah, we'll leave that saber behind. Uh-oh. Which way did it come from? Oh, there's two loads of loot. Oh, that, that's the stuff that I dropped. Okay. I don't know how a dagger turned into, like, a knight's helmet. That's just weird game. Is this a tunnel, or is this just a rest area? Yeah, it's a tunnel. Alright, that's cool. I suppose you can also use that for resting. There's no skin off my scrotum. These skeletons, though, they got a lot of skin off their scrotum. I don't think they even have them. Alright, so... We're doing alright for ourselves. Are, are we gonna end up back where we started? I think this is around where we started. Yeah, I think it is. So it may not be such a bad idea to actually check out those tunnels. If they even lead anywhere. What the hell hit me? Oh. He just knocked me back down. What an asshole. No, I want to get back up. I want to fight you, okay? We're going to fight with honor. Even though you have no heart. Like, or any other muscle. Well, they can't go down here, so I guess I'll just camp again. There are enemies nearby. Where exactly? Oh, it's a minotaur. Don't think I'm going that way after all. Oh, there's an orc here too. There's just a little bit of everything here. This is like the all-star lineup of enemies at this point. Is this also a tunnel? I guess it kind of is. Yeah, it's a tunnel. But I'm going to rest here anyway. So I think there's far few enemies. Oh, this is Mineshaft C. And apparently I cannot rest here because there are apparently enemies nearby. Where exactly? I don't know. But the game says they're there. Okay, where did I rest to that was not a tunnel? Because I want to go back there again. Like, that's my safe haven. Like, somewhere I, I just want to, like, nestle up into... You know, despite, like... Oh! Uh, absolute hostilities. Like these guys. Oh, my lord. I'm just looking for money. Well, you had 40 gold pieces. That's really nice. 
Real nice. If my broadsword is a little worse for wear, I got a saber. Like, a saber. I'll be happy with that. Oh! Got a little too close for comfort. I don't think I got hit there. Huh, <laughs> you had 35 gold pieces and a dagger. I don't want a dagger. I dropped like three of those. They're worthless to me. I think this is somewhere where I can go further. Camp until fully healed. I would like to do that. There are enemies nearby, but at least I got a lot of my health back. Uh... Mary Moo Cow? There are enemies nearby. It'll probably be around where I rested anyway. That means they're just actively chasing me. Oh, Lizard Man! Wow! You did not stand a chance. I didn't think lizards go... But apparently they do. Okay, we just came out of Mineshaft A. I would like to get the jump on that Minotaur that was back there near Mineshaft C. If I can do that, that'll be amazing. Or, you know, he could get the jump on me, whatever works. Out of the way, we'll be engaged in some Mortal Kombat here. With a C, not a K. Save that for Armageddon, which I'll eventually let's play at some point, but not right now. Right now, I got other fish to fry. Oh, there's that Minotaur that was stalking me earlier. These critical hits, man, they are precious. People think, like, why the hell did you pick a thief class that's not tanky as hell? Because, you know, you're going to be taking a lot of hits. And the reason for that is, I just wanted to have a little bit of fun. Also, the thief has like, extra abilities, you know, like picking locks and whatnot. Which I'm still shitting the bed on, because I'm just swinging at locks like an idiot. Like, I'm sure there was just another way to do things, but... Eh, it's probably just, like, pressing P... Just that I'm not perfecting it yet. Oh jeez, I only had like three hours of rest? That sucks. Let me go through this mine shaft, because I'm pretty sure there's like other stuff here that I haven't seen yet. Let's try to go as far south as possible. Hey, why can't I go through here? Is this like a wall? Whoa! What hit me there? Whatever it was, it hit me hard! I bet you it was a ghoul. Cause sweet Jesus, that... That strike was rough. Okay, that's the stuff I left behind. Alright, where have I not been to yet? Oh, there's that safe haven. I just gotta go, like, south and then east. Okay. We'll be fine. I don't know if your armor can break. I'm pretty sure it could. I just don't think I've run into that issue yet. Oh, apparently this is not a safe haven. What hit me? Oh, it was a ghoul. Oh, shit. Okay, it's dead. It's dead. Okay. We're good. Barely, but we're good. Was there another ghoul? Or was that the only one in the immediate vicinity? Because if it was the only one, then we can rest again. Fuck my life.
There was another ghoul. And if one ghoul hits me, I'm dead, it looks like. I do have a potion, but I don't want to use it yet. If it's too dire that I pretty much have to use a potion, then I'll use it. But if I don't have to use it, I'm not going to use it. It's that simple. I'm going to turn left here. Have I gone this way? No, I have not. And if I do, will I get very far? Oh, God! They just stood there! They were point-blank range of killing me! They did not pass... They did not take the opportunity! Oh, those guys are, though. Looks like it was just rats. Let me scout this area a little bit further. Yeah, it's a good thing I never rested yet. There was another skeleton. There might be another one right behind me. Nope. They would have chased me if there was. I should not be wandering these areas aimlessly, don't get me wrong, but... When have I ever done the right thing in this Let's Play? Hardly ever. I am fully healed! Hey! Something good has happened for once. Now there's still, like, the million dollar question. Like, where is that piece of the Staff of Chaos? And if we find it, is it going to be well guarded by some hostile enemies? All sources tend to point to yes. How hostile? I don't know. Probably that hostile. If it's just like an army of orcs, that's nothing bad to worry about. Like, if it becomes like an army of ghouls, then we're kind of shagged. Oh, there's definitely a lot of goodies around here. What should I take? Well... I can't take too much, unfortunately. As much as I'd like to. A bow, though. That may not be such a bad idea. A long bow. I think that's good. Let's think about that. I might venture into a little bit of archery. It's good to know that that's an option. Maybe thieves can use bows. Well, I can imagine thieves using bows. I mean, they have to avoid combat by all else. Other, you know, they don't want to get caught, so they're going to be using missile attacks to make it work. God damn it, there's another ghoul. Wow, you got a good strike on me. Good for you. Sucks to know you got nothing for me. Oh, God! Just a bunch of orcs waiting. Apparently that was the ghoul's gift. He just offered a couple blood sacrifices for me. Man, Fang Lair is just swimming with enemies. Should I take this shaft? I think I should. I haven't really seen a lot of the immediate area I was to, but I think it's time to move on. What was that noise? Whatever it is, I'm taking this mine shaft. Oh. You guys. Hey, Minotaurs, what's up? You guys are just gonna have to cleave this place. Ha! <laughs> Even in Death's Dark Door, I'm very punny. Maybe that's what gets me there faster. 
Did I check this Minotaur? I, I think I checked them both. At least I was able to eliminate that threat pretty early. Again, I just wish I had a little bit more vision around these places. It's just so dark. A lot of holes. Wait a minute. This area looks different. Like, I think we're just getting out of the mine area, and it looks like we're reaching some ruins. You come upon a strange sight. A room with cells down either side, and each cell seems to be a hungry spider. See three more cells along the southern wall. Next to them stands a dark portal. I have this feeling that those spiders are gonna, like, be released from their cells. I wish they didn't have to make that noise. Thou must prove thy worthiness to proceed to the Underdark. The correct answer will open the cell to the gold key, which will open the portal. Rush not to answer, mortal. The wrong choice will open the cell doors to the spiders. Okay... As you near, the door itself speaks. Listen to my puzzle, foolish mortal, and prove that you are worthy of my service. If cell 3 holds worthless brass, cell 2 holds the gold key. If cell 1 holds the gold key, cell 3 holds worthless brass. If cell 2 holds worthless brass, cell 1 has the gold key. Knowing this brave fool, and knowing that all that is said cannot be true, which cell contains the gold key? I think it's cell number two? Thou art correct, mortal. The key within cell two is yours. Okay, which is cell two? It's probably this one. Yeah, that's cell two. All right. How do you pick it up? How do you look down? I, I have the key. Do I have to like not draw my weapon? Pick it up. How the freak do you pick up the thing? Is there a way you can just like look down or something? Guys, I'm... I'm picking up the key. I don't have to pilfer it or anything, because there's no target there. Okay, guys, I'm kind of confused here. No, that's not it. No, that's not it either. I know I am healthy, that's good. But I am annoyed that I cannot pick up this key. I could pick it up when I was like on a raised platform. That's the thing, but this is not a raised platform. How do you just look down? I'm holding shift, that doesn't do anything. My control just makes me strafe. Right mouse button doesn't do anything. Jumping, I don't want to do that. God, like, what is the controls here for this? Hang on, why don't you just, guys just give me a couple minutes? I'm gonna look this up. I'm really sorry, but this is awkward. Okay, I'm back. It turns out I was doing the right thing. The problem is you have to be so specific as to, like, where you're located. You gotta make sure it's still an X, but you have to just grab the key just right. Like, you gotta be so gingerly with it. It's so annoying. Still don't have the key. 
Like, I keep trying to pick it up. Like, right now, I think I'm just too far from it. Oh, I finally picked it up! Damn it, that was so annoying. And the thing is, you have to do this with all the keys that are on the ground. So it's very finicky. Okay, let's get the weapon drawn. Okay. This is going to be absolutely brutal. We are even deeper in Fang Lair. So it looks like we are going the right way for sure. I have no idea what's going to be waiting for us. Probably just more of the same. But they might throw in a few nasty surprises. Oh god. There's three of them! Okay, now there's two. Oh, critical strikes have been a godsend. Oh, so glad those odds of getting a critical strike girl go up each time you level up. So we're doing really well for ourselves here. So, I guess this now would be a good time to call it an episode. So in the next part, we're going to go even deeper in Fanglair. Goodbye, everyone. Thank you for watching.